Could jellyfish be the key to never growing old? Scientists are looking into it. This is T. dornii. It's a tiny, transparent jellyfish that's smaller than your pinky fingernail. And because of its unique life cycle, it's also known as the immortal jellyfish. To understand why, first we have to take a look at how these little jellyfish come to be. Like other jellyfish, T. dornii start off life as larvae that then turn into polyps that attach themselves to something like a rock or a plant. They then develop into the next state, Medusae. Yes, like the Greek goddess, where they start to grow their nearly 90 tentacles. All of this is pretty normal when it comes to jellyfish maturation, except for one thing. T. dornii can turn back the clock by reverting to their previous polyp state. That might not sound that impressive, but it's kind of like if grown humans could turn themselves back into toddlers. T. dornii's reverse aging usually happens as a way of self-preservation when they're injured or in response to starvation. The reverted polyps can then remature back into medusae that are identical to the previously injured adult. This is called transdifferentiation. Simply put, transdifferentiation is when a cell other than a reproductive cell in a living thing is able to turn itself into another type of cell. It's something scientists have been researching for years in efforts to find cures for multiple diseases. Now, back to our little jellyfish. A research team at the University of Oviedo in Spain fully mapped out the jellyfish's genome in the hopes of understanding and eventually recreating its cell process. They found that in comparison to other jellyfish, T. dornii have doubled the amount of genes that restore and protect DNA. They also have mutated telomeres, which are compounds that basically protect chromosomes from aging. These findings are promising when it comes to developing medicines and therapies, but it doesn't necessarily mean people will be immortal, at least for now.